Tonight I was back at it on the 1965 Ford Galaxy convertible. You can see here I'm working on the timing cover, just getting all the bolts out there. It's probably the easiest part of the job. Oh, and of course there's the bolts that come up from the oil pan. Take four bolts out of the oil pan in order to take the timing cover off. And there we are, timing cover off. Next is the timing gears. Zoom the camera in there for a second to show the two dots were pointing at each other. I was quite happy. I found top dead center properly. So the timing gears are off. Now I'm just taking off the hold down that uh, Keeps the cam in. And there. From here on, uh, taking out all of the lifters before I remove the cam. Okay, with all the lifters out, I start trying to pull on this camshaft and it does not want to budge. I found out later, once I got it out, there's actually a chunk broken off of the uh, piece that rides in the second bearing from the front. So it uh, looks like I'm going to have to do some cam bearings as well as the camshaft on this thing. Uh, so when I did get it out, eventually, as you see in this video, um, Upon further inspection, the gear that drives the distributor, every teeth is chewed down to just about non-existent. Uh, and then, yeah, the second second journal is is got a big chunk out of it, and you can see where it ran for quite a while uh, with a chunk beside it as the the shape of the lobe is actually machined into the journal now. So, anyways. I uh, fought with this thing to get it pulled out, ended up having to take the front grill off in order to have enough room to pull this thing out, so that's what you see me doing now. I was not expecting to have to take the front grill off, it looked like there was going to be enough room, but just that extra two inches or so that I was missing. And if anybody's wondering, this is sped up to 12 times. So it took 12 times this in real time to do this job. There I am taking off the bezel around the headlights. And that's uh, where the end of the grill is tied down with a couple little uh, quarter inch self-tapping screws. Somebody's already been in this thing and had this off because on the other side, uh, there's a half inch self-tapping bolt in the bottom. And uh, one of the screws on the driver's side was a different size than the others but anyways 